Good morning, everyone. It is my fateful day. I promised you guys if I raised some money, had some goals, I would spend 24 hours in my truck. There it is. Here I am in a random parking lot because I didn't want to do this in my driveway. And the other parking lot I planned on going to was uh, Ocupado, so it's kind of loud. I apologize about that. Hopefully this comes out. I am next to a uh, next to the highway. So uh, yeah, 24 hours in this. Starting in a few minutes, I'm gonna start at eight o'clock. I'm 12 minutes from that, so uh, I'm gonna be hanging out here, organizing some stuff inside the truck. Uh, may record that now, or may uh, may record that after breakfast, which means uh, on to Wendy's. So uh, yeah, it's the only breakfast in the world, and if you say different, I will fight you. So here we go, inside the truck and off to Wendy's, and then I'll talk more about what's gonna be going on. All right, here's the inside of the car. I did decide to do this before I went to Wendy's. Uh, it's not time to start the timer yet, so I have a few minutes. So, uh, yeah, here we go. This is a 2006 GMC Sierra regular cab long bed with the uh, 5.3 Vortec in it. Uh, I love it a lot. I have tuned it a little bit. Um, actually, I think the tuner's in here. Um, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a great truck. I'm really enjoying it. But it is just a regular cab. It is... It is a bench seat, though, so hopefully I'll be all right. This flips up out of the way, and then, uh, yeah, a bunch of stuff in here. I'll go over the stuff after Wendy's, but, um, yeah, I have a lot of cool stuff planned for today. So I am going to be – I wanted to go visit some people, but everybody's busy. But if you're watching this this morning and you live in the Rochester area, it, yeah, it, hit me up. Um, email me at slicydicey75 at gmail.com, and I will uh, try and meet up with you. Um I am going to be doing some Zoom calls for inside the truck, though. I'm going to be uh, doing one with Nick Shabazz this afternoon. Um, I'll probably put that up like as soon as it's done. Uh, but uh, the other two I may save and do later in the week. I have one with uh, Chad from Southern Edge Knife Works. Go to southernedgeknifeworks.com. Use the code SDSEK at checkout and get 50% off. And uh, Ray from Everyday City Carry. Uh, your boy Ray in the NYC, one of my favorite channels, and I, I always like chatting with him. We always have a good time. We have similar senses of humor, so I think that'll be very good. Um, but yeah, so uh, this is it. Um, I do have a 110 converter in here, so I can run some stuff. There's the selfie stick I used earlier. There's snacks and a bag and a pillow and stuff. I'll get through all that later, um, but yeah, uh, it's in the glove box. It is my, yep, my tuner is in there. You know what? I may even tune it. I mean, that may be some pointless content because uh, it's on 87 performance right now. And since it, I'm just going to be cruising around all day and I need to conserve gas because I don't want to have to try and deal with getting gas. Um, I might put it on 87 economy. I've never tried that one yet. So that'll be interesting to me anyway. But yeah, look for some interviews during the day. I'm going to do some reviews, but those I'm probably not going to put out today. I'm probably going to do those throughout the week and then. There will be some unreleased content I will stitch together to make a uh, a longer video of chronicling my 24 hours. And I'll be posting some stuff in the middle of the night and everything. So, uh, And then the live show, of course, tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern time is going to be from inside the truck. Um, I'm still not – haven't figured out the lighting situation for that. Uh, I may go uh, – may just go to a well-lit parking lot and hope that that works. Uh, we will see. But, um, yeah, so – See it's tonight at 7 p.m. in person, and then there'll be some videos throughout the day. Like I said, I'm probably going to put that Shabazz one up. I may attach a couple things to it, um, depending on how long we chat. It may be a long one, but yeah, Nick's always great. It's a Zoom call. I assume he will be suited up as Batman, so uh, that'll be fun for everybody. But yeah, now um, we're getting really close to the time. I will record me starting the countdown. I've got I've got two minutes, so I'm going to stop this, and then I've got the t the countdown set on my watch, and then we will, uh, then we'll get going. Okay, it turns out I don't have enough hands to uh, show you me starting, but this is the countdown. It's running on this watch. I have another watch with me too, but uh, on this Casio G Shock GW something, 5600 BW. I think it is. I don't remember, but uh, yeah, I like this one because it's Bluetooth, so I could just program 24 hours into the alarm without having to well 23 hours 59 minutes 59 seconds instead of uh instead of having to push through buttons so that's all done the clock's running wendy's ho need wendy's overly aggressive four lane juncture thing merge 55 miles an hour i swear no more than 55 ever officer uh yeah can i just get a uh number two with a uh small coke i guess anything else today uh nope that's it okay, thank you
Oh, they they normally never get it right the first time. All right, so mission accomplished. Got my Wendy's. Oh, the Swiss cheese sandwich is the best, but it's also very messy, so you're not going to see me eat it on camera. But this is what makes Wendy's the best. The sandwiches are great, but these little, the, their little potatoes are awesome. Um, so the drawing for the two knives for the um, Neutron and the um, Grape Ape are going to be this evening on the live show, which is 7 p.m. again. And um, I think, if I can figure it out, because I have to use my laptop and... I haven't used that in a while, so um, we'll see. And then, uh, yeah, the interview Nick Spaz this afternoon. If I can't do the drawing tonight, I'll do it. I'll do it tomorrow. But um, when I'm back on my regular computer that I know uh, how to do things on. Um, and then, uh, yeah, some random stuff throughout the night and the, the rest of the afternoon. So hope you guys are enjoying this. Um, I hope I continue to. I am going to go through all my uh, stuff in my bag after I eat, so... Look forward to that, and then that's going to end this uh, little intro part. Yeah. Okay, so what do I mean? Well, first of all, yeah, audiobook, I made sure to leave so many, many hours left on so I can listen to. By the way, highly recommend Audible, and highly recommend uh, this, if you're into sci-fi, this is the newest of the Bobaverse books, which I kind of thought were done, but they came out in the new one, just in time for me to spend 24 hours in my truck, so I'm very, very happy about that. They're amazing. Um, I like sci-fi audiobooks. They, uh, they make me smile. Um, what do I have for snacks? Let's do that first. Uh, I got... Sorry, this is a very bad way to do the camera. Um, mini Cokes. I like them because when they're in your hand, they make you look like Andre the Giant. They had a little picture of him holding the beer. I am getting a, uh, a cooler later to put those in. And I'm going to have my, my daughter bring me out an ice pack. I uh, did the... REI curbside pickup, which is very handy when you're stuck in the truck. Combos, of course. Cheddar cheese bacon. I haven't tried these yet. I'm not sure if those are good. I only just like the cheddar cheese pretzel. Uh, some beef jerkies in there that I can't get out. And, of course, Snickers bars. I got a couple of them in there. So that's it for the snacky snacks. Um, what all is in here? What you guys care about is just the knives. So that's what we'll bring out. I've got a uh, general stuff. I got, um, I had another watch, but I've already put it on because I'm using, this is just the timer now. So it's just going to be sitting there. Um, put on my uh, Seiko Flight Master. Um, and uh, I got, yeah, some some uh various pills and things and reading glasses uh i forgot to bring another pair of lighter sunglasses um got my uh hydro flask some water in it so uh oh, put his stickers on there yeah so uh i love the hydro flask stuff they are awesome does stuff, keep stuff cool for a very long time um knives are in a vault case uh We'll get to those in just a moment. What else? Laptop, of course. Charger. Uh, anything else interesting? Sani uh, the uh, sanitizing wipes. and um, Yeah, I think that's about it. And some audio equipment. Selfie stick. Pillow. Yeah, and these are my blankets. Spare sweatshirt. All that stuff. But this is what you guys want to see. I think when I stitch this all together, we're already 10 or 12 minutes in, so... So stuff I'm going to try to review, but I'm still kind of curious as to how I'm going to uh, hold the camera and do Eugene Kwan style dashboard reviews, but I'm going to give them a shot. But uh finally got to do the full review on the Spartan Palace, the Microtech Combat Trudon, uh, the name escapes me, it always does, yep. I don't remember uh, this thing. I can't read it. The Teravantium. Teravantium! Knife that the name... Wow, that's bad that I can't... I can't see it. Yep. Don't remember. Gonna have to look that one up again. Um, and the DPX Hest. And this one I, I just got a couple days ago. And it is, uh, it is pretty cool. The Quiet Carry Little One. I don't remember. Eddie. Yeah, the Quiet Carry Eddie. That's kind of cool. Um, pretty excited about that. Oh, yeah, I got a couple flashlights in my bag, too, of course. Get this back 
in their name brand name who's I totally forget I feel very bad about that and then some stuff I have for size comparisons that I knew I was going to need so the usuals and my UTX 85 and the uh quiet carry chase so that's it for knives and stuff um sorry to company whose name I don't remember somebody will put it in the comments there's just too many knives um yeah a couple of flashlights the big one is actually in my pocket, and I was going to take it out of my pocket. I wasn't going to leave it in my pocket all day. But yeah, the uh, big old through night TC-15, and then I have uh, WowTac A7 in my bag also. So um, yeah, got to have flashlights. It's going to get dark. So I um, hope you guys are enjoying this stuff. Again, now this is definitely the end for this little intro video, and I will uh, see you later, probably talking to uh, Nick Shabazz, unless something interesting happens between now and then.